Hey, how's it going, y'all? It's been a little while since I, uh, I've been recording a video uh, of my cancer journey. Uh, it's July 15th today, I believe. It's July 15th. Hold on. Yeah, it's July 15th. And, um, yeah, it's been almost one year since I was diagnosed with stage 4 stomach cancer. I did 14 rounds of Fall Fox chemotherapy. Um, I had a surgery in April to help fix up my eating. Uh, it was awful eating. I couldn't eat normally for a long time. It was ridiculous. Couldn't even drink water. Uh, but yeah, now I just started a new clinical trial at USC. It's a brand new targeted therapy called, called RLY4008. I just started it July 12th, so it's my second or third day, my third day of uh, taking, it's just these pills I take, and hopefully it can, um, it can decrease and shrink my tumor. I have a tumor in my stomach which spread to my colon, spread to my lower abdomen, maybe my gallbladder, pretty serious, it's a pretty serious spread, stage 4 advanced cancer. but staying strong and I'm keeping you guys updated on what's going on so I'm still here I'm still kicking it um, want to swim but I had some complications in May uh, where I had to get a ileostomy bag so I have a have the ileostomy bag right now because my colon closed up on me because the tumor was pressing on the colon I don't I haven't worked but I try to do normal regular day activities you know I try to go to the store do some grocery shopping I'm helping my brother do some car shopping today. Um, when I do eat, I still have some complications. I have like heart palpitation and I feel very sick when I eat. And I feel sick for like 15, 20 minutes. I think it's called dumping syndrome. But um, no, I'm feeling okay. Um, just trying to stay positive and you know, it's a nice California sunny day so I hang out outside as well. Um, I want to get back to work. I'm, I'm very motivated, but I still have some things to work out. Um, they monitor me in this in this uh, clinical trial every week. I have to go into USC, and they have to be there for multiple hours. They take tests. They take notes. Um, but yeah, it's taking pills, and I will update update you guys again pretty soon. But thank you for following me um, in my cancer journey. I'm 34 years old. Um, none of my family members have had cancer before, so it just kind of came out of nowhere. I don't drink. I don't smoke. I drink sometimes. I don't smoke. I was an athlete before this. I played basketball every other day. I worked out all the time. I was in the gym a lot. I, I've been an athlete my whole life. Um, so I don't know. I don't know where this came from. It could have been just environmental, something I might have been eating, something I might have been drinking. Um, stop trying to figure it out because I'll never know but uh, yeah that's my update for today it's uh, July 15th let me know if you guys have any questions maybe I can help somebody out with some questions or anything like that um, but yeah I can tell, you know, answer some questions about what type of tumor I have in order to get qualified for this uh, clinical trial because you have to get qualified for it um, I can tell you what doctors I've used I've, I live in LA so there's some of the best doctors around. I've went to many different places, so I can give some advice on that. So let me know. Peace.